Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rat here from Rat with Tarot and this is going to be Libra Sun, Libra Moon and Libra Rising monthly tarot reading for December 2018 and uh, while I'm shuffling the cards again I want to remind you that this is just a general reading for Libra Star Sign and it is not your personal reading therefore in this video I will do my best to explain you the meanings of the cards and their synergy in the spread but at the end it falls to you to make sense of them and to align them to your personal situation now if you want me to do that for you well that will be a subject of a personal reading and for personal readings please check out my website which is listed down below in the description of this video and there you are to find a full list of my services as well as their pricings and as this is a uh, a December, you know, celebrations, Christmas and all stuff. Uh, the prices of the 20 and the 30 minutes live reading are abated. So if you want to save some money, well, that is the way to do it. Also, if you find these reports helpful and you want to know even more about your months, specifically career and relationship wise, there will be an extended monthly tar reading that can be obtained for just $1.49 from my website. And in this video of the extended, we are to focus specifically on the career and the relationship for the representative star sign. So that being said, this is the five uh, card general tarot spread and at the end of it I will to give a couple of examples how this could chain up and how this could make sense for uh, some specific situations you know and uh, you will see what I mean uh, what I mean that I'm explaining you the meanings and the synergy but at the end it falls to you to make sense of them so uh, for you Libra here the first card which is the topic of your month uh, that is the magician card which is a, a very action oriented card I mean the magician the magician requires from you throughout the month of December to um, have a, a very determined actions it's kind of like almost pushy actions because you are to make some magic happening and uh, magic happening that could be accepted in a many different ways but in most of the cases this is when uh, one is capable to manifest a, a certain uh, dream of theirs or, or, or aim as well and etc etc the magician is the very first steps which one places so a, a goal of their can become reality further into the future. This is a month where you are going to show an, an extraordinary personal sovereignty. You are going to show how strong will you do have and not to mention that as well everybody will notice how good you are with words in the sense of that your uh, communicational skills are going to be at their outer limits as well. The Magician card it is also very positive when it comes to learning so if you do lack a certain qualification or a certain skill in order to um, involve yourself into uh, the dream job of yours well this month of December Libra is the month where you can start obtaining it like signing for courses like applying for a university degree and etc etc and not on the last place the magician is a sign that you are to find that people likes you for who you are also throughout the month of December and those who are lonely uh, this is a, a big chance here that throughout the month of December they are to find a, a matching soul of theirs or like a um, it's not matching soul excuse me but more like matching behavior of theirs so someone which your routine and behavior is completely completely compatible the next card shows the best possible course of actions or the intentions that you should do uh, obtain throughout that specific month and this is going to be the seven of wands so that is a, a card of one guarding uh, their personal estate and their domain as well the seven of wands is a card um, manifesting itself through either in uh, external or internal test of um, how strong you are to sustain what you do possess at that very moment now uh, important here to be said is that this card um, appears in that specific position telling you that most likely you are to be a, a third party involved into enterprises and later on taking the lead on those enterprises so as a um, 
synergy of those cards uh, this is a very well uh, a sign here that you are to be spotted for very capable or very handsome very attractive but in the same time at least at the start of that spotlight you are not going to be taken seriously and you do have a, a great deal of proving yourself that you are actually capable you know to push the project through or to be a um, how can I place it a balanced partner into one intimate or friendship relationship as well so what these cards are pointing here guys is that um, the whole progress of yours throughout the month of December is going to come out with a circum um, with circumstantial circumstances well I'm sorry if this is not the correct expression but it is the closest that comes to my mind like peripheral circumstances and most likely this specific event is happening out of the blue um, uh, just for example here you can be recommended for a specific job and uh, as that recommendation you know the the guy or the girl who has the job for you as you have been recommended will look at a bit skeptic upon you and how good you are in performing it but later down the road they're going to see that you are their guy or a girl as well and etc etc you know that could be also a sign that you are going to be introduced into someone um, you know with intention to make uh, that the, that one which introduced you to that person with intention to kind of like get you together and yet that person you're introduced to will be skeptical about it but the more time they spend with you the more they're going to see that you are their guy or a girl and etc etc it is just these cards are pointing that you should rather uh, be prone to take <clears throat> any kind of opportunity throughout the month possible even if it is a circumstantial one as a matter of fact the circumstantial one is going to give the best result possible in the field the next card that we do have for you Libras this is going to be the challenges which are causing predicaments and that is the choice perfect card for to follow up with these I mean you are to obviously feel reluctant that these things are happening to you uh, or are possible to happen in a sense of that uh, let's say that this card here points that you're going to have great deal of uh, of trouble to accept that someone make the initial push you know recommending you or uh, kind of like introducing you to the right person here and that you did not made it on your own and that's why you may feel a bit resilient you know to investing yourself fully into uh, into this enterprise and so on and so forth so the uh, Kind of like the, the lover's card here points that you will have a, a difficulty sensing the harmony in all this because you know you're not you will not be the one who is initiating it and you are not be the one who um, how can I place it uh, found it on a first place but in the same time you have to be the one who proceed forward with it you know and this is where the lack of the lack of synergy the lack of harmony takes place also the lover's card in a more uh, sideways interpretation it does mean that this is a amount where you should neglect your previous problems and right now focus on this goal of yours or this opening that it is um, created through a circumstantial event uh, in your life so if you had for example difficulties let's say or you have fought with your uh, intimate partner and this is all about career for you now you need to leave those uh, fights in those wrangles in the past and focus entirely on your career or um, vice versa you know if this here is this happening into your intimate front you have been introduced with someone that do have a potential to create intimate relationship but in the same time you do have currently problems at work you need to leave these problems at work in the past and focus entirely upon creating your intimate relationship and so on and so forth the next card that we do have this is going to be the guidance that Taro is offering to you and that will be the princess of pentacles or the page of pentacles so the page of pentacles here plays a role of a event or rather of a code of conduct so uh, this card here points that 
the good things are happening extremely slow. The good things are happening when one carefully examines uh, the soil forward, when one makes a, a thorough preparations for it, when one creates meticulous a plan how to proceed on forward with um, with the activities that are yet to follow which kind of like has a, a very poor synergy with the magician card so somewhere along the way as soon as the foundation of that thing is is established you know you should allow yourself to be led rather than to be the one who leads all right and uh, that kind of like contributes to the meaning of learning here i mean you need to learn new things and in order to learn something new you need to be led forward so therefore here it is very important not to presume what is going to be the outcome of a certain situation or what is going to be the outcome you know of a certain uh, romantic empathizement project that has been brought to you or you have been involved in is the more accurate term to be used here as that is something that it is currently ongoing but you are to be involved in as a, a circumstantial or rather like a side person you know like a contractor for example and etc etc but here again it is it is important not to be biased about the situation how you take a participation of that enterprise but more to be focused on the uh, what happens next and being very thorough with your further approach and meticulous with your performance and the last card that we do have this is to be the final outcome for you that is the tree of pentacles and the tree of pentacles it's a very positive card for building uh, a positive card for creating societies and also having a, a, a support through your development so how this card, this card manifests at the end of the month it is most likely uh, where you are going to kind of have a retrospecting uh, a period there analyzing the whole thing that happened and making notes you know on which could have been done better either into your career or either into your relationship and also creating the plan for it but not without a asking for uh, opinion of those which are as well involved into that situation either career-wise or either relationship-wise the three of pentacles here points that you are to start building up a, a very big and solid foundation of something huge that is going to take place further into your future either a, a long-term relationship or a long-term project but you here are to define that you are not ready yet you know to uh, manifest it because more needs to be created as a foundation of it otherwise if you try to build it straight away is going to uh, fall into ruin therefore this card here points a, a very solid dating for example or a um, negotiations for a new job for a new job contract as well through which you are going to also find a, a support that can be also exerted about your development uh, so uh, this is all in all, you know, the explanation of the cards and uh, their synergy. So what we can have as an, an example here, as I started, that could be you have been introduced throughout the month into someone that first is going to find you as a, a very, um, you know, mundane person, as a, a kind of like a generic introduction here, uh, when they are not going to put a, a great thoughts into it while the more time then they spend with you the more they are going to see that actually you can be someone very interesting and as when someone that they can make a relationship with if we're talking about relationships here and <clears throat> doing so they will become a little bit more tenacious you know spending time with you and it is where you have to be more meticulous and methodical you know being uh being the balance force into this uh, into this empathizement and at the end a, a serious conversations in between you and that person you have been introduced are to happen into uh in attempt to kind of like explore what possibility this future commitment could have and where it could go for or uh, career wise you can be involved circumstantially into a, a certain project in your work or a third party freelancing <clears throat> 
job as well which uh, you are going to be face skeptical at the start but the more you uh, perform the more the person that is on the leading of the job is going to see you know that you are actually someone that it is very valuable asset for the job itself and it is where you should kind of leave your uh, pride on the shelf and you know your cockiness as well and become a little bit more tamed and patient patient with the whole process of the job here with the page of pentacles and most likely this is going to lead to lead to a, a big offer around the end of the month like starting a new job like offer for a promotion or for additional job as well in which you can participate forward and build up a additional money so that being said libras this was your uh, monthly tarot reading for December 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and uh, again this was just a general reading for Libra star sign and it was not your personal reading. Therefore in this video I did my best to explain you the meanings of the cards and their synergy in the spread but at the end it forced you to make sense of them and to align them to your personal situation. Now if you want me to do that for you well that will be a subject of a personal reading and for personal readings please check out my website which is listed down below in the description of this video and there you are to find a full list of my services as well as their pricings. Rod signing out now. See you next time. Bye.